Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. Derivation of the equations of motion for simple harmonic oscillators. Answer. The equations of motion for simple harmonic oscillators can be derived using Newton's second law of motion and Hooke's law. First, let's consider a mass, m, attached to a spring with spring constant k. When the mass is displaced from its equilibrium position, the spring exerts a restoring force on the mass, given by Hooke's law, f equals kx, where x is the displacement from equilibrium. According to Newton's second law, the sum of forces acting on an object is equal to its mass times its acceleration, sigma f equals ma. For a simple harmonic oscillator, there are only two forces acting on the mass, the restoring force from the spring, kx, and any external force applied to it, if any. Therefore, we have sigma f equals kx plus f underscore xt equals ma, since we know that acceleration is equal to the second derivative of displacement with respect to time, a equals d caret 2x slash dt caret 2. We can rewrite this equation as m d caret 2x slash dt caret 2 equals kx plus f and fx t. This differential equation represents the equation of motion for a simple harmonic oscillator. By rearranging terms and assuming no external force, f underscore x t equals zero, we get d caret 2x slash dt caret 2 plus k slash m x equals zero. This is a second order linear homogeneous differential equation with constant coefficients. The general solution for this type of differential equation takes on form xt equals echoes omega d plus phi.